Ok. I'm Miss C. And we're from... E.T. E. Speaks from Home. Home. And today we have this mind design of robot. Mind is an intelligent robot and it introduces children into simple designing and coding. It's the same and above. Inside this box there is... A list of commands, 30 washable pens, the instructions, a board and a bunch of A3 size paper. Without forgetting mind of course, which does not need assembling and requires four AA batteries. There are three modes to play, free to play mode, educational mode and app mode. You can find the switch on the right side of mind. Remember to place mind on a flat and smooth surface. Now we're going to demonstrate a few ways to play with mind. So to draw with mind you need to step one, turn it on to free to play mode. Step two, take your washable pen and place it through the hole. Press it deep enough that it will go through. And then on the bottom, as you can see, there is a clear cylinder uh, thing. You want to take that out and then place it on a blank sheet of paper. Select the shape that you want to draw by pressing this. Shall we, draw, shall we draw a rectangle? Press OK and he will begin to draw. Put me on a blank sheet of paper. Then put a felt pen into my back. When you're done, press OK. Ready to roll. And there you have it, a rectangle. So to draw with mind using your voice, you need to, first of all, turn on the mic. My cybernetic ears are active. I'm listening. You know if he's listening by the red dot. You can only talk when his mind is yellow. Hi, what would you like to do today? I really feel like drawing. I'm listening. Let's draw together. If you want me to draw, put me on a blank sheet of paper and put a felt pen into my back. What do you want me to draw? Let's draw a pencil. And there you have it, a pencil. So to play with mind on the educational mode, there are two ways to play. The yellow board and the blue board. The yellow board is to do with maths. The blue board is to do with uh, coding. The blue board only has one difficulty, but the yellow board has three. So to select your board, you press the yellow or blue arrow. We're playing with the yellow board, so we select the yellow, yellow board. Yellow board selected. Place me on start and press OK. Let's find number seven. So you have to move forward, turn, then forward, forward. You can also use the voice control, but I prefer to use it using the keypad. Seven. Correct sequence. Outstanding job. We must reach number two. Your turn, Missy. Okay, so if he's facing this way, we want him to turn this way. Then we go forwards, forwards. If he's already facing that way, we turn this way. Then we go forwards. There we go. the app mode you first have to download the app, connect it to mine and then draw your shape. As you can see Missy has drawn her shape and is beginning to press play. Ready to roll! The app is continuously being updated and, that, and therefore you have tons of games to play. There are two main features of it, coding and drawing. <clears throat> it's quite easy to draw the thing uh, and you can select how you draw and where you draw.
And as you can see, it's finished. And looks exactly like the real thing. What I like about mine is how easy it is to program mine. And it's just fun programming him. I like it because he can draw shapes and pictures. So if you do have any questions, do pop by my comment page and I'll get to you as soon as possible. But for now, bye!